Hey guys, it's me Greg and welcome to another video. So, I know last week I said I was going to do a blog about the Janet Jackson concert, but I recorded nothing. <laughs> so yeah, sorry about that, but um, basically it was a great concert, one of the best I've ever seen, and if you have not seen her yet on this tour, you should totally go see her. Anyway, I'm not talking about that today, I am talking about my favorite items in my collection, so yeah. Well, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to show you guys is something you probably have never heard of and probably don't even know why. It's one of my favorite items in my collection, but it is the Michael Jackson Thriller 25 Thriller Fan Pack. You probably don't even know what it says. Basically, it's just a box set that has the 25 CD DVD and the number one's DVD. So nothing special, right? <laughs> Wrong. This thing is one of the most expensive things. I have in my collection. I paid $25 for this, but like this thing is valuable. Like this thing is worth $100, $175 I've seen sometimes. Yeah, and I have this still sealed by the way. Like those things I've seen, like the $175 ones, I've seen those used. This one is still sealed, shrink wrapped, everything has never been to open. So um yeah, I am like proud to have this. Right on the have. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to show you guys is the Michael Jackson 1 Christmas ornament. It just has the Michael Jackson 1 logo and a little ornament ball, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, nothing really special in the back, just kind of the front is the coolest thing about it. So yeah, cool item. Not that much to say about it, just it's really awesome and I love it. So yeah. So if you've been subscribed to my channel for at least two months now, you've probably already seen this item because it was in my new items video for June 2018. But I have to speak about it again. I love this item so much and I just I need to talk about it again. It is the Entertainment Weekly Michael Jackson's Video Nightmare magazine. I love this magazine so much. Um, I don't know what else to say about it basically. Like I've said everything I could have said about it in the new items video. It should be up here somewhere if you want to watch it. But yeah, just it's a great magazine. I am so proud to have this item and yeah, just I love it so much. And I got it in my mint condition also, like <laughs> I could not ask for like a better condition for this item, so yeah. Let's move on to the next item. So I don't have that many CDs in this collection video, I just kind of wanted to showcase a lot of the miscellaneous stuff, but I had to put at least one in here, and this album is amazing, I love it so much. Yeah, um, it is Michael Jackson's Dangerous, I adore this album so much, and yeah, I just, I love it so much. If you're wondering what copy this is, it's an original USA pressing from 1991, so that's cool to have. But yeah, it's just... A nice album I love it it's great every song up here is amazing and yeah so if you have not heard this album you need to right now like click off the video I don't even care just listen to the album it's great a lot of people think Moonwalk is Michael Jackson's best book and probably his only book but actually he had two books and I believe this one's a better book by like a long shot that is Dancing the Dream I love this book so much I like read it recently and I think I love it more than I did the first time I read it like the poems are amazing, and yeah, just the pictures are awesome. Also, like a lot of them are from the Dangerous era, and there's like a lot of black or white pictures. Remember the time. I think one from the MTV 10th anniversary celebration. So yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff in here. A lot of you probably are not used to this cover. This is like the original 1992 pressing, I believe. But like they changed the cover to like a beat it pose. I don't have that copy of the book. I only have the original pressing, and I'm glad because I was like looking specifically for an original pressing from 1992. It's a really good book. There's a lot of poems in here. It's really well written and yeah, I think Michael himself said this book was better than Moonwalk because it was not about the controversy and stuff. It was just about him talking about himself and what he's what he loves and stuff. So yeah, good book. So the next thing I'm gonna show you guys is something I didn't even buy, but the Michael Jackson store sent it to me. It's a long story. I wish I could like describe it right in this video, but it would be like 20 minutes, so um Maybe later this year I'll make a video about it. Tell me in the comments below if you want me to, but um, It's the Dangerous 25 hoodie. I did not order this. They just sent it to me because I guess they felt bad for giving me so much trouble with my order. Again, I'm not going to get into it, but <laughs> yeah, um, here's the hoodie and here is like just the Dangerous logo on the back and the Dangerous 25 logo. Yeah, um, this is a really cool item. I'm not sure how, how many people have these because uh, I don't think a lot of people bought these. No one wanted it. But, um, yeah, it's a cool item. I like it a lot. I wore it a lot, actually, last year. But it doesn't put me anymore, so, um, yeah, it's kind of just, like, in my closet now. But, yeah, it's a cool item. Um, if you see one and it fits your size, you should get one. It's really nice. The next item, um, means a lot to me, because the first thing I got in my collection, kind of, was the Michael Jackson 1984 doll. 
It was like a hand-me-down from my mom because she had one when she was a kid and I she bought it home one day because I guess she was gonna sell it, but I kind of asked for it. And she gave it to me. And I was like, ever since then I wanted one in the box in making condition. And this year for my birthday, guess who got me one? My mom. And yeah, it was the one American Music Awards doll in the box in mint condition. I love this thing so much. It looks great. Um, it looks really nice. It's kind of damaged on the sides, but I really don't care. I just was happy to own this. If you find one of these on eBay, you should get one. They're just great to have. I love it so much. And yeah, it's just one of my favorite items in my collection. So yeah. This thing is really rare. I am so glad I got this like five years ago when they were still in production because they have become these collector's items that are like so rare and so obscure to come by. It's crazy. That's the Michael Jackson Smooth Criminal Funko Pop figure. I would only dream of having the rest of those figures. These are like so expensive. I don't know what happened. I guess they just stopped making them and that's why they're so rare now. But yeah, this one's just a Smooth Criminal one. It looks, you know, awesome. <laughs> the box is really great. And yeah, and yeah, just like look at it. It's great to have. I love it so much. I wish I could just have the rest of them, but who knows? Maybe one day I can come buy them for like a cheap price. But as of right now, that's not gonna happen. So yeah, um, really cool item. If you come buy one of these for like a really cheap price, like I think under fifty dollars, pick it up immediately. <laughs> So that's really all I gotta show you guys this week. Um, next week I'm planning on doing a video that a lot of you probably really want to see. I'm not gonna tell you what it is. <laughs> You're just gonna have to wait. But yeah, so follow me on Instagram and Twitter at randomboots2012 and subscribe if you like this video. So yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching and until my next video.